What's going on guys? It is Wild Strong and DSG here and I'm back to another Blackburn Rovers career mode. Guys, make sure you check out Loot Crate and use my discount code WDSG on over there. But anyway guys, so this is a training mode special. We are going to be featuring some of our squad. Actually, I might do, I'm going to do a one person special, uh, which I kind of love in this game. No, actually no, tell I'm not going to do it. I'm going to do someone else. I'm going to do... Where is he too? I want to do a youth player. I'm going to do Columbo. Because Columbo looks like to be one of my promising youth players I got going on at the moment. To be honest, we're going to get rid of a lot of rubbish in January. We want to try and loan them all out. But if you did miss last episode, I mentioned something about January. A lot, lot big stuff about January, guys. So, um, what I'm planning to do in January is to sell Gabriel. I'll see I will give him the chance very, very soon, whether he can slot into the team or not. I don't I honestly don't know. I wanna sell him. I wanna get rid of him. I, I I just can't work with him at the moment. I'm gonna give him the opportunity, of course. I will play him in a few games. He's gonna have to play. But we're slowly getting into our momentum now. We haven't actually played him. Like we've been very lucky with our results, but I haven't actually played him at all. So, maybe we get rid of him and then we sign someone like Callum Wilson, who I know will be a very, very good player for us, right? And we have, say we sign for like 15 million, we won't sign for 18, without a doubt, he'll be a lot, lot less. Say we sign for 15 million, that means we have a good 30 million left over, depending on how much we sell Gabriel for. And then what I'm going to do is sign Daniel Surridge on a free in January and get him next season in season four. So, that'll be an absolute boss sign in that world if we get him for free. He'll be 30 years old by then, but he'll be a very, very good player. 84 rated, we get him for free. It'll be a big, big wage, but we do need to sell, sell Gabriel first before we do it, before we offer him a contract. So, straight away, Gabriel will be sold. So, let me just show you. He, he, he can't be put up for sale yet. i got to wait till January before I can actually put him up for sale because he has been purchased this season. I can put him up for loan. But he's just not good. People saying his confidence is out and all this rubbish. But, like, he's got a very, very cheap wage. But, like, I don't know. He might come in to Mojo. He might come in. It's just that's what the plan is at the moment. But uh, make sure you check out those previous episodes, guys. But last, as well, we've got a lot of stuff. Tammy Abraham, he played a little bit. He got almost scored. Tammy Abraham almost scored. Um... For us, which was kind of getting, I was like, oh no, couldn't believe it that he couldn't do it. But anyway, we're doing a Columbo session. Uh, where is Columbo? Oh, he signed, didn't he? I forgot he signed. I thought he was one of our youth players. We're not going to do difficult ones. The only reason for that is because he won't improve. Um, we're going to just possibly do like silver ones and everything just because he isn't going to improve. He won't do that well. But look, is it? Apparently, Gabriel's improving. I don't see it. If I'm honest. But <laughs> anyway, apparently he is. But actually, I'm going to put Gabriel in. We're going to see what we can do with him. We are. I'm going to put Columbo on a, a volleys as well. But anyway, let's join this training session. See how we can do with my main man, Columbo. See if he can discover his shooting boots. He will be loaned out in January without a doubt. So I need him to get his playing time. But as I was saying, we are considering saying, uh, selling Gabriel. I could start him against Zenit St. Petersburg, who we are playing uh, next game. So, that's kind of... We could start him. I could possibly bring him on as a sub. Last game, I didn't bring him on as a sub because of um, Abraham wanted to... Uh, he wanted to start. So, oh, God damn it. Damn it. Oh, he's got me. He's got me. I, oh, I got him. Oh my god, I got him. Ah, uh, I slotted in. Anyway, we got an A, they're very, very good. But anyway, as I was saying, I don't particularly want to bring him on. Like, I'm, I'm, I do I bring him on? So next episode, we will consider risking it. Maybe we play him against Plymouth Argyle. <laughs> like, maybe that's what we do with um, Gabriel. That's what we do with him. We play him against Plymouth Argyle because he is... Um... Oh, damn it. That was not good. Good, good. Oh, what? Is there a keeper in there? Just run forward. Good, lovely. Sorts it in. Lesh. Well, it's good. We got quite a good um, 
team. Shoot, and he's in the banner. We got a good team that can actually finish, other than Lascelles, which is current. No, that's Gabriel. Oh, there we go. He scored for a change. Lash, love it, Gabriel. Absolutely love it. Oh, that's Tammy Abraham. Oh, Tammy Abraham skied it. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Come on, Tammy Abraham. You can do it. Get those shooting boots back, my friend. All right, that's our right back. It's not Tammy Abraham. He got a B in that, so it's not too bad with his through balls there. But uh, anyway, yeah, like I was saying, we'll consider giving Gabriel a run around. Do you think we should only play him against Plymouth Argyle? Or do we play him against Zenit St. Petersburg? Because our team is working at the moment. And Zenit, I want to win. And we don't want to be the first team to actually lose. Because in our group, no one has lost yet. Everyone has drawn. So we don't want to be loser. Well, to be fair, we played Gabriel when we played... Um, oh my god, we can't keep the, hitting hit the post. Just getting in the back net. There we go, Lovely. But uh, anyway, as I was saying, we don't want to be losing. But in fairness, we did play Gabriel when we were... Um... Oh, it's off the post. Oh, it's over. Finesse. Bar. Finesse. Over. Oh, my God. What foot are you? There we go. It's in the back of the net. There we go. Chance is created. We had a C. That was not good whatsoever. Speaking of Gabriel, now he's coming up now on a chance creation. But... Um... Yeah, I'm kind of hoping we can turn this around like a four. We now got two on the bounce, which is absolutely huge. But in all fairness, the two on the bounce that we did were we we scored an own goal and we beat Spurs 1-0. Like, it's, it's not really good. But in all, and uh, we had Simon come on as a substitute. That's how we did it. Gabriel, no, nothing good whatsoever. There we go, slot, <laughs> see it in. Squares across. Lovely, jubbly, cannot beat that. Oh, it's Gabriel, he's on it. Shoot, good shot. I'm going to give him a chance. Like, if I can just keep training him. Finesse shot. He's a left footer. Oh, I just realised that he's left footed. If he's left footed, I, I need to put him. What side do I need to put him on? I, right, Simon plays on the right. Oh, yeah, he needs to be on that side. He's already on the side that he plays. Maybe I switch him around with Simmer and just see Simmer one. Just see what he actually does. See how well he does it. Like, has he got that? He does. Well done. Um, maybe that's what we do. Just got to keep trying. We need to keep trying it. We can't knock him out. Like, it was like with Werner. When we bought Werner, we kept trying him and trying him. And then every so often, he would bag a goal. So, maybe if Werner was actually playing with a second season, he would... Do very, very well for us. Um, but obviously, of course, 50 million for him. When you only pay 13 or something, you can't complain. Oh, we pay 17, so. Trying to just go for the shot to try and improve. He's got a very good right foot as well. Lovely. Tammy Abraham. Maybe Tammy Abraham and um, Gabriel up front. Honestly, I don't know what we can do. It's just I don't want to drop Simmer one, who's playing very, very well at the minute. Maybe we have to try, we'll have to trial and error this in our Plymouth Argyle game. I think we will. I think we will. Plymouth Argyle will be like the one where we test most of this out. Oh, <laughs> lucky Abraham. Like Abraham and Gabriel just haven't scored. They, they have not scored at all. They have not done well. It's an A. So it's pretty good. And I'll bet the Columbo. He's doing his uh, volleys, headers and volleys. So, hopefully this goes well for him. We don't want a bad training session, do we? Oh, this Defenders. Oh, good save. Good save. Oh. Why are you bringing in the Defender? Honestly, like, that's going to help me. I didn't score any. Oh, my days. Oh, Alonso, we get, we get 200 points if we connect with it. Oh, bicycle kick. Oh, what? That went straight to him. Oh, it's off the post. Why have we got a keeper? Honestly, we can't have a defender and a keeper for someone who's 60 rated. This is meant to be easy. I don't think this is a gold one. Oh, my God. We got an F. Oh, that was a sweet connection. Oh, and he blocked there.
Come on. Because it's Head of the Vault, he's got it the first time. Oh, that was an F. Oh, it was a D. It was a D. I gave him the D. But anyway, Columbo has improved quite nicely. Gabriel's improved quite nicely. Where of getting an A there. He's almost 85 rated. But Columbo, with an A, with a B, and a C, and a D, definitely look like my grades in school. But hopefully we can improve a bit more. Because we are going into the of St. Petersburg next episode. Which is a big one. Potential international jobs popping up. Let's have a look. The Netherlands, Chile, they're all after us. Honestly, Argentina won us, but we don't play and Wales won us back. I don't know. I honestly do not know what to do. I don't want, actually, I'm not going to worry about it whatsoever. I don't want to be in international duty right now. But, is there anything, Petersburg? You know what? I'm going to give you an exclusive right now. We're going to try Gabriel and Abraham up front. I'm going to leave Jack Burnley. I'm going to leave Jack Burnley. And that's the side we're going to go out with. I'll mention this next episode. But he did well in the training session. Abraham and him did well up front. So maybe we give him a go against in the next few games. Um, and see how they do. Because, of course, we play Zenit. Then we play um, Swansea. So, to be honest, if we don't do well here... I won't play him against Swansea, but I'll play him against Plymouth Argyle. So then, they can go in and absolutely batter them, if I'm truthfully honest. But guys, that's the end of this episode. Hope you all did enjoy it. It was one of our training specials. Looking for all the stuff. I want to show sure you the board expectations, how well we're doing. So, we're doing pretty well. FA Cup, we haven't played yet. We've done well there. We've signed a youth player. We haven't done a youth thing yet. Um, and we need that's by the end of the season. So, current fans are 6 million. So, we'll see. But guys, I want to say thanks for watching. Not good enough states Griffiths. Oh, it's because I put him up for... What? Not good. Oh, after an interesting season so far, it's clear that Griffiths has a few frustrations. It's been a funny old season so far. When questioned about Gabriel, he simply replied, I don't think he needs any improvement. Improvement. His skills are sharp. He keeps a very positive attitude. Began the Bratburn Rovers manager, but I would like to see him be more ambitious out there. Finished by adding, I know he's capable of a bit more. I plan to get that out of him. Oh, <laughs> okay, okay. I've been talking to the news about Gabriel. Ooh, that's interesting. Of course, um, oh, I forgot his name. Orichi, I think, Orichi or something they call him in the commentary. He's doing pretty well. But anyway, that's the end of this episode, guys. Hope you all did enjoy it. Will we beat Zenit St. Petersburg and go top? next episode. So guys, fans watching, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Do it for the love, for the love, yes I do So you don't care about the money, well yes it's true And I'm so blessed to be fulfilling my destiny All material things could mean less to me Only thing I ever could need Is a Sarah B sample with a dope ass beat And get the mic check, all the levels right